Hello, and thank you for watching Accelerate with Nerdio. In this video, I'm going to walk you through adding, customizing, and managing a multi-user remote app host pool in Nerdio Manager for MSP. So what is a multi-user remote app pool? This is going to allow you to publish apps, but not desktops. To the end user, it'll feel as if native apps are running on their local device through the WBD client or HTML browser. And remote apps can be spread across a collection of session hosts to allow for you know, some redundancy and load balancing. So how do you build one? Let's go ahead and jump right into Nerdio Manager for MSP. We'll see that I've got a remote app pool built, but let's go ahead and walk through those steps. So I click Add Host Pool. I would name it, provide a description. I'm going to choose Multi-User Remote App Pooled. I'll fill in the usual information for a prefix, uh, image, and again, that image is going to need to have the applications that you want to publish, uh, and then some sizing and quick assign can be used as well. Once that's done, I'll have a host pool like this one, and this is our multi-user remote app pool. I can configure the description like I've done here. I'm going to publish Excel and MS Paint through this uh, pool. Um, I can give it a friendly name, which the user will see in the client. Um, I'll see that there are things like um, load balancing that can be configured. I can go in and manage user sessions, user assignments. Um, I can go in and review the hosts. I can see I've got one host here. It's available. But let's take a look at how we actually configure the apps. So if I click on the drop down here, I go to manage, I go to remote apps. I can actually click the add remote app option and this will allow me to um, work against my template and publish the app. So in this case, I've got Excel already published and I'm going to add Paint as I promised in the title. So I'll click Add Remote App. I can go ahead and look for uh, MS Paint, or I think it's under Paint here. There we go. And we'll give it a friendly name. I'll call it MS Paint uh, and I'll say Paint Program. Now, I can set some other things here, which I'll discuss in a later video, like command line, but I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. We'll give this just a moment. And there we go. It's now added in my list of published apps. And when I go and log in as a user assigned to that pool, I'll see those options available to launch. And again, that workload's getting spread across the host that you create. So please check out the auto scale video that will accompany our remote app host pools and definitely check out help.nerdio.net for access to more of our videos and documents. Thank you very much.